are associated with the red blood cell membrane. All right, and the antibodies are in the plasma. So make sure you know that. I think some of you already knew that, but make sure you jot down that little tidbit where the antigens and antibodies are. And then the antibodies, uh, O blood has A and B antibodies. Okay, now you remember this from lecture also, that, and this is what you saw on my slide right here. Here's what you saw on my slide, and that is that this doesn't mix. In other words, this is what you saw right here. That doesn't mix. In other words, anti-A agglutinated type A blood. And that's what I am. All right, and anti, and it's shown the little egg white, the uncooked egg white, clear looking stuff. That is, that, that says anti, anti-D. And anti-D is, it can translate that also into anti-RH. So I'm RH positive, so anti-RH, it's again, and look well, another way to remember this, everybody. Where it says right here, it says, it says anti-A, the blue, anti one way to remember that, it's against type A blood. Anti-A is against type A. And it also stands for antibody A. <coughs> the antibody A is against type A blood. Anti-B is against type B blood. All right? Anti-D is against the RH. So that's one way to, a little mnemonic type thing that might help in remembering this stuff. Might help you a little bit on that. So there you have that. And then another thing, everybody, and I didn't bring my blood type. I, I try to get my little blood donor card between lab and lecture when I have it in my wallet. It just gives my blood type, blood type, and uh, that sort of thing. Uh, you know, and my blood type and my RH factor. And so if you're, you know, if you're in a car wreck or something like that, and you're say you're well, heaven forbid that you are, but say you're unconscious and you're bleeding, you know, they need to. They would be good if they found that on you real quick and knew what blood type you were. Might save your life, okay? You might might do it.